Hi everybody. So we're going to talk about leash walking today and um, I want to make the, the distinction between walking on a leash, like walking on a sidewalk, walking into a building. I call that leash walking and then the difference between trail walking, which is when I would use a harness and a long line attached to the harness. So there's some pulling action there from the puppy because they're dragging the long line. So I don't want to mix the two up. I want to make sure that I use a buckle collar so he understands the distinction. So when he has a buckle collar on, he'll be right next to me. So in the beginning, when the puppy's really little, Ripple is six, up, six months old now, but when he was really little, I would just work on him standing and just having this leash on a buckle collar and keeping it loose and keeping his attention, Ripple. And I would just, when he was really, you know, watching, cause not when he's jumping, but when he's really watching, I would put the cookie on my knee so I could draw him to me. And so he is always with me close and not um, getting distracted and pulling. Cause that's really a lot of what the pulling is about. It's about there's something more interesting than me. So <laughs> I have to be a little bit more interesting. So it depends on the dog. Sometimes I'll use my voice. Sometimes I will use, I, I do use a lot of food, ripple. Um, and I want to make sure that I don't give the food out here because then the leash is a little bit tighter. So I want to make sure that he knows right with me is the way to be. So we'll just kind of walk around a little bit like this and have him follow me. Yeah, that's a good boy, Ripple. Um, before we ever start really walking with it. I'm going to keep the cookie up here. Hi. Uh, 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 uh. Nope. Okay, so for him, clearly I can't show him the cookie because he's, he's jumping. So what I want to do is try and keep it out of sight. He knows it's in my hand, but we're just going to try and walk. Yes, that's it. Look at you. Look at you. And notice the leash is loose. It's caught underneath his foot here, but ba -ba, yay. That's it. And we're just kind of, I'm not even focused on him being on my left side because he's showing me he's really jumpy and that's it look at you so even though this really doesn't look like leash walking this is really getting him used to being on the leash with it on the collar and not pulling so we're just yes that's it just trying to keep his attention so that's really the first step so notice now he's following me because I have the cookie up, 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 up. Yes, that's it. Oh my goodness. And we just keep changing directions. Woohoo. Whoopsie. This way. Yeah. That's it. Yes. So he learns that I'm interesting. I'm not going in the same line because if we go in a, in a straight line for a while, it's boring and they end up getting interested in something else. So I want to keep changing my direction and to try and keep their attention and periodically give a cookie. Ripple, yes. So I picked up his nose by, by, by putting the cookie in front of his nose. That's it, yes. That's a very good boy, yes, yes. That's a very good boy. Come here. Yes, that's a good boy. <laughs> 